the much awaited infosys springboard internship is out and you can do this internship in different fields like artificial intelligence data visualization full stack and more and in this video i'm going to tell you entirely about what this internship is for who can participate how can you register because the process is a bit confusing and you might lose on this opportunity if you don't follow it correctly and most importantly last date is 2nd of june so make sure you watch this video and share it with all your friends whom you think should participate in this and without any further ado let's get started so now we'll be seeing how can you participate in this internship i'll give the link in the description which you will click once and click on get started then you will be asked to log in if you don't have an account already you can create your account you can register if you have an account already you can log in via otp or phone or your phone number once you log in there are are some terms and conditions you need to sign in for these terms and conditions and this is uh, how your dashboard would look like so they have this virtual internship 6.0 you need to click on apply now once you click on apply now you will see what this internship pattern who is eligible what you will be getting you'll be getting in-depth technical knowledge there are so many courses that you can learn from for free and use the, that knowledge to build on real world projects then there'll be practical experience working on some specific project that infosys is currently working on so you get the real world experience and within your college you get that certificate from infosys for an internship expert guidance you can learn from industry leaders and become part of the community and virtual connect there'll be uh, you can continue to attend your college while engaging in this eight weeks virtual internship eligibility anyone who has passed his class 12th you can be a btech student from first year to final year m tech mba mca bca bsc or diploma student also each and every one of you is eligible if you are currently studying something then you can do this this internship is to provide project experience to students generally we don't have that project experience so the most important thing is the nomination date it is open only till 2nd of june and it was announced on 27th of may so see the competition that a lot of students will be participating and it's not just that everyone would be selected a few would be selected you need to fill the nomination form and by 2nd of june and to be eligible for this internship you need to complete the courses by 30th of june so i'll tell you more about what kind of course and what are these uh, after this and uh, you will be shortlisted it does not guarantee that if you have completed your course that you will be getting an internship or not so it depends upon the slot availability and first come first so the earlier you complete the course the better are your chances of getting shortlisted so post selection internship journey how would that look like so batch allocation stay up you need to stay updated there will be attendance lease participation contribution so all of these things you need to keep in mind if you are participating you'll be getting a certificate of internship completion based upon uh, what all milestones you have achieved and milestones are structured into four it's four milestones two weeks each how you can apply you need to click here right and you can do this internship in different fields like artificial intelligence angular full stack python technology stack java technology stack and data visualization any of these fields you can check out and how to apply just need to click on this link once you click on this link you will find a survey link right so this is the survey link that is loading and you click on this survey link so it was open from may uh, 27th and it will open till be open till june 2nd 11 pm so you click on start survey accept and start and you fill this form here also when once you're filling this form uh, above all all the basic details but here once you come you need to select which track you want to pick for example artificial intelligence right this is very important note that which track you are picking so if you have picked artificial intelligence choose which course you are from let's say for example you're from p-tech you're from second year and you will be graduating in which year 2026 are you a working professional no this is for only students uh previous internship experience and no then you need to click on submit right once you click on submit then you will be uh like you will see what, what the kind of courses that you can complete right so once you click on artificial intelligence so there are so many courses here that you need to complete before 30th of june so they'll tell you about the milestones if you are enrolling in for ai internship then these are the courses you need to complete if you are uh, aiming for angular full stack internship then these are the courses you need to complete if you are aiming for uh, uh, python technology stack then these are the courses that you need to complete and if you have any queries make sure you send out an email to springboard support at the rate infosys.com they'll be very very happy to help you right and infosys springboard internship alumni speak so you can see what kind of uh, folks participated in this internship last year or last two last year they have a gallery here where you can access what all things they have achieved so this was all about this internship i hope the video was clear and all of you are applying for this internship also i keep sharing a lot of content on my instagram make sure you do follow that instagram channel and join the telegram group where these opportunities are shared very regularly this was all for this particular video thank you so much all the best good luck and bye